Hi, this is Miko Amagamu of Icing, and today I'll be showing you how to tint your Second Life clothing. Um, we'll be looking at the Icing First of Spring outfit, which is white, and will take the color quite nicely. And the first thing that we want to do is go into your inventory and find a clothing folder. Let's go ahead and make a backup copy that we'll work off of. So I'm going to right-click into the folder, New Folder, and I'll just say First of Spring, and let's make it red. Let's select the pieces that we're wearing and right click copy and then go into the folder that we just created and right click paste. Um, so let's put that on by right clicking on it and hit add to outfit. So let's work off this. Now there are going to be two components that we're going to be working at um, on this outfit which is going to be the clothing textures as well as the prim pieces. So let's work with the prim, prim pieces first. Um, let's right click on the skirt and go into edit and there's going to be a little more button here. Let's expand that out so we can see all the options. Um, we're going to be working with the texture, so let's click the texture tab. And there's a uh, little color box here that once you click, it'll open up the color picker. Um, we can select any of these sort of presets here, or we can sort of fine tune the, um, the colors. Um, let's go with a nice pure red. Let's go on this one. And then here you can just, um, pick how deep the color will be. So. That's, that's a nice color. I can go ahead and drag this color into one of the free open slots here so I can easily reference it for later. I'm going to select that and we'll see that this is nice. It's not too dark so as to sort of completely obscure the color here. If this was black then we would see none of the shading that was here. And um, let's go ahead and hit edit and let's repeat the same thing. It's right here for easy selection so select and now we've gone and tinted our two prim pieces. So it's looking pretty good so far. And the next step is to tint the actual clothing texture. So to do that, we right click on the avatar and go into appearance. And she'll hopefully turn around for us. And there's two pieces. The shirt is the first thing we'll tint. And again, you'll see the sort of tint box here. It works much the same way. Uh, click in the color tint box to open it up we can select the color that we created before and we see the top is tinted there and then the last part would be the glitch pants so if we just sort of excuse the upskirt <laughs> shot here uh, the pants uh, select the same color and let's just check to see if it applied yep that worked so let's save all of that and close it up and we can see that everything is tinted here. Now notice that the black band here hasn't really taken any color. If it's too dark, it won't. You, you can't obviously tint a black outfit white, but um, you can uh, experiment with a lot of different colors. It doesn't have to be a white outfit. A lot of lighter color outfits will take colors pretty well. So just experiment and have fun with it. And um, that's it. Okay, thanks.